and it's aux beam on the front, and then the Colite Rob 2 Pro on the back. It's pretty neat. All right, it's a foggy and kind of rainy day right now. This is low beam. High beam. I'll show you the aux beam uh, 5D Pro and then the rigid with the ember cover. I'll show you that the rigid first. Rigid. This is rigid with the uh, ember cover. It's pretty nice. And then coming aux beam. Oh yeah. It's got a very focused beam on top. I'm gonna show you what it looks like off the vehicle. Don't know if it's uh, clear to you guys, but look at that spot beam in the middle. It's super focused. And the ember here is from the rigid. And just to show you what I have for the chase light, I have something for the chase light in the back. Well, this is the ox beam for, for now. And the chase light. All right, chase light, oops. That's perfect. That's good, that's good. Let me clean up the lens real quick. Chase light. Let's see, it's illuminated to the back. Sox beam on the front and then the Colite Rob 2 Pro on the back. It's pretty neat. It's throwing a lot of light in the middle and something to the side. It's like it's the spot in the middle and then flood on the side. And then I turn on the Fog light. Also amber. So now everything's on on my vehicle. It's gonna be a lot of light. I like the setup. All right, I'm gonna show you one more time of uh, all the light, everything off, everything off, right? And low beam, high beam. I'm gonna keep the high beam on and turn on the uh, aux beam, 5D Pro. Oh yeah, so you can see a lot of sharp beam in the middle. So that's aux beam 5D Pro and the high beam of my Tundra. All right, and uh, ditch light, uh, rigid ditch light. I'm gonna shut the door for you. Ditch light. 
see on the side, right? A lot of illumination even to the side of the vehicle. And it's pointing not really sideways. It's good. As a side shooter lens. Off screen. Yeah. Just cut through the fog. And back to low beam. I just want to show you the fog light. That's the diode dynamic uh, SS3 Pro fog pattern. Yeah, it's pretty good. So you can see it's not as white as the rigid. See, so I turn it on and bam. So, yeah. Turn it off. Beam. I'm trying to see, show you what the pattern for the ox beam is. Since it's on top of my Lear cap, there's no reflection on the hood. However, it's big shadow because of the cabin is blocking that much of light, which is fine because I'm mainly using it for a spot pattern. It has some side illumination. Oh, I can see some. See. rigid only. Clear cut off way to the back and everything is limited. And rigid plus ox beam. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I don't even have my car's light on. Now it's on. Thanks for watching guys. Leave your comments below have any questions all right just gonna show you what the ox beam looks like while driving this is just the ox beam this is my uh, <coughs> low beam plus ox beam that's rigid so yeah ox beam as you can see is pretty awesome show you Alright, thank you guys for watching. The links for the products reviewed in this video are in the description below. If you like any of them, just uh, order them through the link. That will really help me out uh, in growing this channel. And thank you for watching. Have a good one.